Why, hello, hello, hello. Hello again to you. Hello from freeziness from the cozy cabin right now. And yes, the heater does work. Um, I just didn't do a video inside because it is pretty hot. It's really pretty cold here, actually. Um, it's not snowing yet, but this morning, like, it was a slippery slide up the hill. I don't know what I'm going to do when it gets worse. Uh, but the sun came out, and when the sun comes out, everything's, like, all like melty steamy, which is pretty cool. I haven't done a video in a couple of days and I will tell you why. You guys know I always cry on my videos. It's just what I do and, and I really like that stuff. Um, but as far as like what I was depressed about, um, I shouldn't have been. And I realize now I have every right to. <laughs> Depression comes in so many different ways and colors and feelings and shapes and sizes and you name it um, but to be real waking up with no reason to have depression and having depression is depression who cares about that um, but I will tell you my depression and why so um, I've been talking to my boys a lot uh, like a lot a lot and Today's the tenth of April, and here I am splitting the hair, you know. This is going to be embarrassing. Hello. We're going to be like, why are you talking to a cousin? Please, now I feel like an idiot. Anyways, I've been talking to my boys a lot, and I didn't talk to my boys a lot in Las Vegas all that time because they didn't want to share their problems with me or their struggles or their happiness and their greatness that was happening because, you know, they're so stuck up in their own And now that I have the cozy cabin and now that I'm pretty safe all the time because I do have friends uh, that can come to my aid and I do have a place where I can take a shower if I need to and stuff, you guys talking to me is blocked. And it's been overwhelming. Um, overwhelming with gratitude for the things that I have in my life. I know that might sound weird, but that's kind of how it is. Right now. Right now, that's how it is. And it's because I'm feeling like a mother again. And when I had, you know, a home and I, you know, had a job and, you know, living a normal life, pretty much, except for you know, all the other stuff that was happening. Um, I was talking to my kids all day. I would talk to my kids all day long. And there's my boys that don't live with me would come and to hang out for two, three weeks straight, you know. And so I'm getting that back. And it's not that it depresses me. I don't know. It makes me just want to cry all the time. And yesterday I was at the Goodwill, and I was walking around in the Goodwill and um, texting one of my boys back and forth with him, and I'm just holding back the tears because it's what I always did before, you know? I'd be in the grocery store and get a, a FaceTime, you know, and I'd answer it and, you know, talk to them. I couldn't go anywhere <laughs> without talking to them. And I'm starting to get that back now. And it's just different. You know, kind of like when I got the cozy cabin, it was so overwhelming. And when I, you know, I had my first home cooked meal, it was so overwhelming. And my first hot shower with, you know, blasting water was so overwhelming. This too is overwhelming. I'm so grateful for my boys, you know, that they aren't selfish little brats. <laughs> because they didn't want to share that thing, those things with me is, is because they loved me and they didn't want to hurt me, you know? They didn't want to share the things that they were struggling with because they felt like I was struggling more and they didn't want to share the great joy because they felt, you know, that I wasn't feeling joy. And I wanted to be there all the time, but they didn't believe me when I said, no, you don't understand, I'm okay, I'm okay, and I was okay. I was struggling, you know, we all struggle, you know, 
know what I mean? If you have a lot of money, you struggle. It's just part of life. But I wasn't doing it on video, you know, so they didn't. Actually, no, actually, one of mine just said they just landed. So let's talk about Thanksgiving. I'm not going to cry about Thanksgiving. Uh, two of my boys went out to visit uh, the pizza place that I talk about all the time. And if you're watching my videos, please. Uh, they flew out this morning. So glad that two of them went instead of one. Because <laughs> I could get into it, but I'm not going to. Um, and I'm happy for that. You know, I'm happy that they're together and they're going to have Thanksgiving with us. And that means a lot. You know, it really, really means a lot to me. Um, of course, they can't come out here because. I'm only two hours away from them. I'm not far, um, but it is uh, pretty cool. And um, if it snows, I do not want them driving. You know, uh, they're still in school. So I'm I'm grateful that they're here. So even though it's going to be cold, um, they are going to have a great time. Um, and I'm going to try not to cry about Christmas. <laughs> it's six minutes. Um, I don't want to. I'm looking into job possibilities for a couple days a week. I just don't know. I feel like I don't know. That's the problem. Like, I go into panic. Um, so I'm not going to talk about that today. Um, we are having Thanksgiving tomorrow, and my friend's husband is out of town. Um, and then she's having her niece and husband come, and um, her son's coming down, which is really, really cool because – there was a whole bunch of people. I don't even know if I could do it, you know. Um, just because I still haven't talked to a lot of people, you know. It's, what, seven months in the woods where I never talked to anybody. Um, and it would probably be overwhelming for me if there was a lot of people. Um, but everybody kind of knows my story. Um, there, a lot of people, a lot of people think way worse of me. And I probably would have been dead if I didn't have my YouTube channel because you guys allow me to vent and talk and say, keep going and you're strong and you've got this, you know, and donate to the GoFundMe and once in a while someone will put some money in my trust. I mean, that is like a part of my family that I live with. I mean, they're such good people in the world and especially my channel. I don't know how you got here. Um, sometimes I put it about, you know, the first camping. Sometimes I put it about my own life. Sometimes I put it about the fact that, however you got here, um, I'm grateful that you got here. So. I'm not going to keep going, um, but just really, really grateful that I can keep on with all my boys. And it's just a big team, you know. It's just a big team. I look perched. I look yucky. <laughs> oh, what? One more thing I wanted to tell you about. Um, when I went to the Goodwill yesterday, I went to the Goodwill to um, get, you know, like an outfit for Thanksgiving. Because, as you know, all, all I have is a piece of paper. And the majority of them are from being homeless, so I wore them again and again and again. <laughs> But I couldn't find anything. It's not that I couldn't find anything, you know, pretty or whatever. It's just that clothes fit me really weird, you know. And, ow! And even if I, you know, found some of the stuff, I don't even have any nice shoes, really, you know. I mean, I have some nice winter boots. I have Uggs. I have Uggs. I have really cute Uggs. So... That was another reason why I was crying, like, oh, I don't even have any clothes. I'm going to be in sweatpants that are ten sizes too big. But you know what? It's Thanksgiving, where you're supposed to be grateful for everything. And, you know, invite your enemies to eat. And accept them exactly the way that they are. Or where they're at in life. 
and I know nobody would judge me, so I don't know why I'm, I was judging myself. I'm not judging myself anymore. Anyways, have a happy Thanksgiving if I don't update tomorrow, but I probably will, you know. I probably will. Okay, have a great, 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 great day. And I hope you have off, gosh. I really hope you're not working on Thanksgiving. And if you are, I hope you're getting paid so much. <sighs> okay, bye.